Hello. So today we're going to try. I asked her, I said, what do people normally get? She said, soy garlic ring wings. I already X that off the list. And then she said, these bad boys. These are, now I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing this right. Bulgogi tacos? Bulgogi tacos? I'm not sure. I'll spell it on the screen. Bulgogi. Bulgogi. Boom. That's what we're looking at. Mm. You look at that. Tell me that presentation isn't beautiful, son. I think this is beef or something. I'm not sure what kind of sauce it's got on it. It's got some lettuce in there. Got uh, some iceberg lettuce. Looks like some uh, some cabbage or something. Or, or some slaw in there. Beautiful. I'm going to get right into that. But also, as a uh, side, I figured this this is not cheap, by the way. These were $13 for these tacos. And then I'm going to hit y'all up right here. This is this is some heavy, the, the weight to this bitch is something serious. Now look at this. This is a uh, chicken fried rice. Now look at the presentation on this. This right here is the most impressive. The tacos look good, but peep game out right here. Son, what you know, look at that. Look at the presentation on that. I've never seen such a beautiful presentation on some chicken fried rice. Um, I wish I could have got some chopsticks, but they didn't have any. Uh, show y'all, I do know how to use some chopsticks, bro. I'm, I'm, I'm OG in this Asian food. But first time I've tried uh, Korean food, so maybe I'm not OG. Mostly I only eat Japanese food or Chinese food. But uh, today we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna go with the um, this uh, was it chicken fried rice? Yeah. I'm gonna try this chicken fried rice. It's got the cucumbers. It's got the green onions galore. Sesame seeds in there. I've never even seen that in there before. We got chicken in here, eggs in here. This is beautiful. I would put some soy sauce on here, but I want to try it straight from the, straight from the, you know what I'm saying, straight from the source. So we're going to hit up this. We're going to get one of these. We're going to get some rice in there. Oh, they got, they filled this thing up with chicken. Bro, they weren't stingy on the meat, boy. Look, look at the body of that. That's chicken. That's every bite, son. Yo, this is no joke. Mmm. Son, let me hit that. They put this in here for a reason. I don't know what I mean. mm. This ain't even the main course. Let's get to the tacos. Mm. One more, a few more bites for me. This best fried rice presentation I've ever seen. No, I haven't eaten it in many five-star restaurants. If you have eaten at five-star restaurants, this is probably not the best presentation you've ever seen. But for me, um, mm, this is beautiful. All right, now let's get to the tacos. Let's try this out. Hit this up real quick. Mm. That's a different flavor than I expected. Tastes like some teriyaki kind of in there. Mm. I don't know what that sauce is. And you know what? Doesn't even matter what the sauce is. It's beautiful. Mm. Mm. Here you go. Here you go. Mm. Oh, you can eat it if you want. Mm. This is a nice flavor, though. Tastes nice and clean. Mm. Mm. Yo, I'm a fan. For real. This is a nice little flavor to it. See? I saw this. I just like to try a whole bunch of different restaurants. This whole year, I got a challenge for myself. I'm gonna try to try 
10, 100 different restaurants in the year 2020. Well, I'm going to start today. This is number one. But for the whole of the year of 2021, I'm going to try to try 100 restaurants that I've never tried before. Because, you know, everybody, you got your McDonald's, your Burger King's, your Chick-fil-A's. You know what I'm saying? You have frequent spots that you stop by and there's like a hundred million different restaurants all around you that you guys just pass by all the time. So challenge yourself, go out of your comfort zone. You know what I'm saying? And also, did you know that somebody said that if you ate at a different restaurant every single day of the week, including the weekends in New York City, you would you wouldn't have to repeat restaurants for like 25 years eating at a different restaurant different restaurant every single day that's how many restaurants there are and all we eat at is mcdonald's chick-fil-a and i'm not knocking them but we got to do better man all these restaurants hurting I feel like this is the perfect time to try this. No, I don't live in New York. That was just a little style note. Uh, please drop a like if you like the video. Drop a dislike. Uh, hold up. <coughs> please drop a like if you like the video. If you dislike the video, tell me why you dislike the video. And if you f with the vibe, please subscribe. It's always appreciated. And um, peace.